Man, Rooster, it's got to be 5 o'clock somewhere. Oh, oh, oh. To you know, this is that show. I'm Bishop Rooster. <laughs> it's been a minute. It's been a while. We're excited. Yeah, we haven't um, been here minute. for a little while. We've had lots of injuries. Stuff. We've had all kinds of yeah. shit holding us up. You see this stagger yeah, see right there? See this slice? Yeah. Uh, I'll put a picture of the injury when it happened up on the screen right now. So you can. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you can see that? Oh. Jesus Christ! Yeah, it's just a flesh wound. <laughs> just a flesh wound. It's fine. It works. Everything oh works. Oh my God, bro, that looks so. It's healing up well, though. No, it, 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 looks, it, looks it still looks like a Frankenstein finger, though. I mean, it's like, oh yeah, it's crooked. It, you know, either that or either that or it's straightened out, and the other one's crooked. I don't know. I can't figure that one out. But it's that, still a little swollen for sure on there. You know, the funny thing about this happening was is the doctor. The doctor was adamant, 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 adamant about making it brand new. And I said, hold the fucking phone. Does this look new? <laughs> I'm like, this is the scratch and dent aisle. This is what you get a bargain for, right? <laughs> right. This is not new. I haven't been new since the day no, I came right. out from mama. <laughs> So but he was concerned about it healing up with no scar and like all that. Oh shit. yeah, they they you know they with physical therapy they're doing it's it, the funny thing is is like the finger exercises are really easy. Okay. Right. It's just you have to build it back up. Yeah. They focus more on the scar tissue. Yeah. Right. And I get it because that scar tissue underneath can actually Im impede that tendon and uh -huh. everything that I that I did sever. Hmm. I was gonna uh, ask if, it, if you actually said. Oh yeah. It. yeah. Oh yeah. Had, had it hit the knuckle just right, probably would have popped the whole thing. It would have cut the whole finger. <laughs> off. Yeah. Fuck. But luckily, there's bones. stones in there. Your bones. Stop it. <laughs> and Jesus so it Christ. came in at, at an exact angle, and it and it hit the it hit the actual joint. So we're good. Thank God. <clears throat> but but it has been too long. Seriously though, it's been over a month. Yeah. I, we last time we were just talking, we were like. Oh, we're coming up next, 100th episode, we're getting there, you know, getting close. Crickets. Yeah, <laughs> it's been life, silent. life, right? I know. Life. All this different shit has happened to us, it's been crazy. Right? <laughs> oh, yeah, by the way, old man edition. Yeah. See the glasses? I told him he's trying to yeah. impersonate me. Yeah. He's yeah. looking good. No, I, got, I got a lot to go with the hair. That, that's, <laughs> that's a long ways down the road. <laughs> right? <laughs> no, but life, I'm just... It's yeah. been it's been insane. It's uh, there's lots been going on with you, with me, yep. just with you know everybody in yeah, general. Exactly. It, it, everybody went from being this boxed in, like quiet, you know, don't don't talk to me, don't come next to me, don't, don't don't do it, don't do it, and now everybody's like right here, all the time, in your face. What's going on? Back up. I'm not back saying up. six feet. I'm just saying. Back up. I don't need to smell that subway you just had. <laughs> right. Back up. I don't know right. what it is. Dude, uh, fucking, I was too close to somebody, obviously. That was part of the reason we'd taken some time, because I got the fucking vid. Oh, yeah, you did. I forgot about that. I was that. down for like a whole fucking week. Fucking sucked. That was right when I came back from my week of working in Idaho. Yeah, but you, you also got exposed to like some... Weird variant that's yeah, running around yeah. up there, you know. It was because I was surrounded by fucking hundreds of people at this meeting, you know. Mm -hmm. So people are asking me to plug in their computers and get them so, coffee. So how did it? How did it feel to uh, have the vid? It felt all right. I got. Uh, I have the vaccine and one booster. Oh. So I wasn't very sick. I was like stuffy nose uh, and. Uh, a little bit of a sore throat for like a week, but the real, the first two days was like nauseous and headache and that kind of shit. And then that went away and it was just like coughing and sore throat mm -hmm. for the rest of the week. So it wasn't actually bad. If you're debating getting the shot, I don't want to lose half of our audience here, but <laughs> my friend Grant didn't and he got the COVID and he was so fucking sick. He was well, like, we're also talking about somebody that also has a lot of other ailments. <laughs> Grant? I don't know about like immune ailments. Oh, uh, well, I don't know. I mean... <laughs> I don't know, but, I mean, but so I, for me, I feel like it definitely made the sickness way less severe than it could have been. So I don't know. Chicken soup. Chicken soup. <laughs> It'll solve any problem. Chicken soup. <laughs> it's good for you. Don't worry about it. Uh, 
<clears throat> it's kind of crazy because even with it, it, even in the media, the way that they portray it now, it's like you'll see a blip about it. Yeah. Right. Yeah, right. It's a spike. <laughs> yeah. It's not like it's not you know mainstream all the time. Partially because you have to take a second mortgage out to fill your goddamn gas can. Why? Seriously, though. I do not understand what is going on. Dude, and we I, had an episode a while ago about gas prices, right? Oh, and now it's like way higher oh, than it was when we were bitching. Well, well what's funny is, is I, with what I do with work, I talk to a lot of people in a lot of uh, supply positions, right? And so months ago, uh, a couple suppliers said that, you know, come this fall, you know, by this, by this time this summer, they said, oh, we'll be, you know, pushing $5 a gallon. And by this fall, we'll be pushing $6 plus. Jesus. And I was like, eh, whatever. <laughs> no. I should have asked them who's going to win games. <laughs> I should have asked them what the Powerball numbers were. Right. <laughs> because they were right on it. Right. You know, now, fortunately, in our area, the, the prices have dropped a, a little bit. Oh, have they? But... Not significantly enough for there's, me to go. There's still over oh, five bucks, right? No, I mean we're 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 below five. Oh yeah, we're below five for just regular fuel. But, yeah. I mean, you want to put the good shit in? Yeah, you're yeah. you're spending over five bucks. Yeah. Uh, but man, talk about a rough summer, dude. <laughs> are we going to the amusement park or <laughs> are we going to be able to get to work? <laughs> right. Do I go to work or do I eat? <laughs> Interesting. Dude, all this fucking... This is a, just another topic. All this shit about Biden, dude. Oh, God. I've been dying. Did you, did you see the one of him trying to read the teleprompter? Oh, well, this is like the second or third time <laughs> where he's like in script. He's like, acknowledge audience and wave hello. And then he just continues reading like he didn't even realize <laughs> that he wasn't supposed to read that. And I was like... Oh my god. And that was just one of like 20 videos I've seen recently. I don't know who the fuck are the Dems going to choose to run, bro. Who can they choose? That's what I'm saying. Who can they choose? <laughs> I mean, I've been watching it. I've been watching it across the country. And the country right now, like all the Democrats that are up for re-election are running uh, unopposed. Right? Yeah. But then there's like, at a minimum, like three Republicans running against that. And... They're all like, and, and we've already gone past the primaries, yeah. right? As far as, okay, well now we're going on the next phase, right? And it was just an onslaught of red. <laughs> I mean, it, okay, so Colorado, Utah, Wyoming, no, no surprise there. Uh, Kansas, Missouri, Oklahoma, New Mexico, Arizona, uh, even in Oregon and Washington, there's been some, there's been some upset on who's running there. Wow. And I'm like. What did you expect? <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> I'm sorry. This is why you don't let your kids drive your car. You buy them the junker and you right? let them wreck that. Right? <laughs> you don't let them in the nice car. <laughs> you just don't do it. Right. But, hey, it's one of those things. Don't touch that stove. <laughs> don't do it. Don't. Don't. <laughs> Told you. Oh my right. god! But that I mean, but it, at, at, at the very base of everything, we have to be able to sit back and laugh about everything. Oh yeah, because if we get that worked up about it, there is no hope. Seriously though, yeah, you can't let it drive you crazy and no. get you spiraling. That because that's what like twenty five percent on the each of the extreme ends. I feel mm -hmm. they let it get to them and let it rile their emotions, and that's like. And it starts to turn you into a fucking crazy person. You're just like, whoa, chill the fuck out. No, I mean, I, it, you know, while you say crazy person, I, I see a lot of people that I thought were crazy, like literally, like in, in our social groups, that I thought they were out there. And now they're going and they're looking at the shit going on going, how are we going to fix this? Because this isn't okay. Like, you're the one that's walking around in like three week old pajama bottoms that need to be washed and two different <laughs> pair of shoes and... I'm pretty sure it's a nacho stain <laughs> on your T-shirt. You're like this guy gets a good when, when you when when you go out and and you're concerned about what the fuck is happening in the regular world, like right. That, that's a that, that's that's kind of a big eye opener to what's happening. Right. Like people are like, this is not okay. <laughs> I am not sure that this is the same planet. Right. <laughs> So, <laughs> yeah. Plan. Dude, they were talking about lowering the voting age. Oh, yeah. I was like, you yeah. want more fucking idiots 
Like, yeah. I, it's just, I mean, and I was the same way. You just don't do research as a kid. You don't fucking look into things. So you hear something and you're like, that's the truth. Like, and you base your whole fucking assumptions off it. I'm like, who wants 16 year olds fucking voting on national issues? Well, uh, but I mean, think back when you're a kid and you think you know it all, right? Exactly. And my voice is important. Yeah. My voice. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing to contribute to society? Right. <laughs> it, what what essential piece are you locking in there in that gear cog that is right. actually making this wheel turn? <laughs> yeah. N no, you're 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 making weird TikTok videos, and uh, you're arguing about who ate the last fucking bagel bite. <laughs> that is hey, what you're doing. That's a real issue. We oh, need to worry about this. We'll country. scratch the last part. <laughs> Jury, disregard that. <laughs> so Get that from the record. Yep. No, but I mean. It, it always happens, but at the same time, uh, we've had other issues that have been like pushing forward, and uh, and, and we won't we won't get into any of, any of the other big ones because I know there's been a lot of tragedy lately with shootings and things like mm -hmm. that. We won't get into that. We'll get into it later on down the road. But there are there there is some things happening that I think could be beneficial, but at the same time, I feel like. We got to be real careful how we press into some of this stuff. Right. You know, it's like New York and they're in their passing of what they did for being able to buy a gun. And that's another whole what episode. What is that? No, what, I'm just telling okay. you right now. That's like, I guess I'll learn it. If you that is a whole <laughs> nother episode. Like, I mean, it's, it's ridiculous. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> Dude, but yeah. no. It's but it's good to it's good to it's good to be back. I know, seriously. It feels good. It's great to be back, seriously. Hi. Get a little beer. Beer? He's the one burping today, no. Seriously beer. though. <laughs> He's the one burping. Right. No, but uh I, I don't know. There's just been I think we're good. when we come back after our refills, I got a really cool topic because I know yeah. you're gonna geek out on it. Cool. And um, oh my god, just speaking of geeking out, I don't know if we want to put a whole episode into this, but that fucking Obi Wan, bro, we haven't even <laughs> talked about that yet. <laughs> we can we can we can dive into yeah, that. Yeah. We can dive into that. But there there's definitely been some really cool stuff happening uh, um, in, in the world itself. Uh, there there's just been. In the world of business and all that kind of stuff, crypto market, oh my god, hold on! <laughs> yeah. Hold on! This is like that roller coaster dip that just keeps going right. and going and going and going and going. And at some point after you've pa after you've woken up from passing out two or three times, you're like, this is okay. Right. It doesn't feel that bad. Right. I'm just waiting for that whiplash when it finally snaps back up. Right? But man. Right. Woo. You remember we had just told you guys in one of our Alaska episodes how we had dive into this BUSD crop farmer, mm -hmm. and as you can imagine, uh, that didn't necessarily go quite as planned <laughs> with the whole but, with the whole market. I mean, we made our money back, which yeah. is all that mattered. But. Yeah, we're not, we're not. I mean, I think we're at a what, a ten percent, fifteen percent loss. Yeah, so we're at eight hundred bucks right now of the. Yeah. So I mean, we're we'll be okay. Yeah, yeah. We're okay, but the the point is, is it's like. <sighs> It's just one of those things you got to trust your gut and sometimes it doesn't always pan out um luckily we're not holding our shorts exactly <laughs> we're not holding our shorts i'm actually partially kind of excited for this dip mm -hmm. of like the economy because it's like this is how millionaires get made you know like getting in yep. now when everything's low and cheap it's yep. like you can buy fucking shit and over the next 10 years it's gonna go way up so yeah i mean this is a it's a good i mean everybody's afraid of the recession yeah. And don't get me wrong, that's not that's not the greatest thing to live through, right? Because it, it gets stupid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it gets stupid. More so than what we're we're used to right yeah, now. Yeah. But um it it does turn around and then it, it bears a fruitful market afterwards. Exactly. Yeah. So I don't know. It's just good to be back in the saddle. I'm all you know, I I would say I'm about 60 70 percent oh, that's actually pretty good i was expecting a lot less mobility in your finger though so why oh, you think i can sit so <laughs> i can't sit still i can't sit so still. you just all day been sitting here doing this oh no since day one <laughs> i mean literally like right after the surgery i'm like hey, 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 please work Come on. Just, i know it's like willing it to happen <laughs> Use the force, Jake. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's just been one of those things. Not my first rodeo. I'm just glad I didn't lop the whole thing off. Yeah, seriously, though. You know, but I will say my surgeon was amazing. And uh, the whole procedure only took 28 minutes. Whoa. 
So I told him afterwards, I said, you know, Jiffy Lube and Grease Monkey can learn things. <laughs> you can't even get a damn oil change in 28 minutes. <laughs> I was like, for real? You were the man. Did they have you out or what? Oh, no, I watched the whole thing. Okay, nice. Hell yeah, that was probably super cool. I watched the whole thing. Freaked him out. <laughs> I was the very first patient. He's been practicing. He's been doing this for 12 years. I was the very first patient that wanted to watch it. Wow. And he was like, okay. <laughs> watched him do it all. That's cool. That's freaking sick. So we need a refill. Yep. And when we come back, we got a really good topic to talk about. So we'll see you in a few. That does it for today's video, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe to, you know, that show.